It is a cool yet windy day here in New Jersey, yet it's time to play some golf. You know the rule of thumb. Anytime it's above uh, 30 degrees, we're playing, as long as it's sunny and not shitty out. We are here at Skyway Golf Course in New Jersey. Nine hole setup that's very American links. Not a lot of trees, but a lot of undulations around the greens that you have to be careful of. Breaking par today when it's 50 degrees at the peak and windy is gonna to be tough, but we just have to take our medicine, play smart golf, try and get one on the par fives, and we can get there. Let me go take care of paying. It's only 30 bucks, which is great. Warm up, and then we hit the links. All right, we got 120, pins in the back, winds behind the back. Play this middle left, let the wind bring it in, full swing. Back there. I think there's a gully middle left that I went down. That did not not go well. Nice shot. Long putt to start this off. I did not make this easy on myself. People really need to learn to fix their ball marks. I didn't get the putt beforehand, so I'm not sure how fast they're rolling. I'm not sure if you got to either. Okay. Thank you. I think we get a little bit of break in that, but... Oh my god. I can't believe it. Oh Jesus, what was that? I tried to saw it off and just held it open. That was bad. 100 yards. That last shot like shit. Right. Here we go. Play it right, let the wind bring it back. Too much. I feel like putting this is gonna be better, especially up the hill. Uh, that's a lot of bumps there. No, it's too many bumps. It's not flat. And it just stuck. Uh, thank you. Oh my god, really hard working for it, bogey. That's always fun. Bogey, bogey start isn't great. Uh, less two shots out there to the left now. I need to make sure I'm turning them over and not scared of it. Uh, but we can get this. We got it. We're fine. Par five, wind to our back. Beautiful scenery behind the hole. Then you turn around and right out into the open. Oh, that is so far left. It's so far left that it's actually fine. <laughs> it's in the next fairway. My alignment is off. Two things to note when I'm playing rounds like this. One, yes, I do get everybody's permission in the group uh, to film. Like if nobody, if people aren't comfortable with me having the camera, even though I'm not recording them, uh, like obviously like it'll be sitting nearby on the green they'll be picked up but I'll edit it out but like if they're not comfortable with it obviously I don't uh, record and second the views on this course from this course are immaculate I mean that's just a thing of beauty oh my god now granted the hole we're going to is way over there but still Definitely think one of the guys in the group uh, two ahead of us hit my ball because I found a plugged Pro V1 right nearby where I was supposed to be, where I came down at. Uh, and another guy had already hit there. So I'm guessing that's it. I'm not a big fan of like the whole lost ball thing when you know it's in the middle of the fairway a hole away kind of sucks but I'm guessing that was it I have no clue so I'm gonna play that as if it's my first one somehow sent that uphill shot over the green so hitting three from here it didn't roll out wow that's terrible 
Thank you. One, 129 to the pit. Wind is dead right. Go. Go. That's so bad. No, I just didn't hit it well. Thank you. I just realized my camera fell over. We're looking at about a three foot par putt. Let's go tap this in quick. Thank you. Two back to back pars. Uh, good up and down on that one. Par five. Uh, the one prior, again, not taking the penalty strokes just because I know they stole the ball. It literally landed right in the middle of the fairway. There's no other uh, reasoning or explanation. So still two over as we head into the very long par four fifth hole, especially into the wind. I think it's gonna play like 550 for a par four. 450 yards with that wind. Thank you. Uh, it leaked out to the left. Wasn't bad, but wasn't great. The only reason the camera is able to somewhat stay up is because my bag is holding it up. 78 yards, wind in the face. This hits 80. Can't do it. Oh, that yanked so far right. Did not stop, thought it would. And that one, I thought it was straight. That curved way right. That was horrible. Double bogey, four over. Yeah, I don't have to worry about that. not tell yet whether I can get a three wood under this or not. Oh yeah, that's three wood angle. Absolutely. I was hit horribly, but I got down too far on it. Took the ground out from underneath it. Very nice guy from South London uh, in our group and was asking me about like YouTube and you know filming everything. Is this my full time job, which I always then explain obviously no, it's not. But then we started talking about esports and like why I do YouTube content, etc. Always fun to explain to people because like he's learning about esports. He's like, oh, it's the next boom. And it's like uh, middle of esports winter. You start thinking otherwise. But I mean, it's still fun to talk to people about that type of stuff. Expose them to a new world. Maybe they check it out after a bit. Who knows? Anyways, we got a wedge shot here. Uh, a good look at birdie if we're going to get one. 90 yards on the dot, but wind is to our back. I'm thinking I can't stop it from going high. Don't high. So I'm thinking sky high 58. Let it drop right on it. Carry that win. Re I thought I hit that pure. I guess not. I guess I hit way behind it, but I could have swore I hit. I okay. I don't know why I'm trying to play summer distances in the middle of freaking winter. It's dumb on my part. You shouldn't be doing it. Take the club up, take your medicine, go from there. It's just bad. It's Bad golf management on my part. It's a little short, but we take it. Thank you. Let me take that par. Wind is in our face, massive bunker short, so we have to make sure we get this right on the dot. 145, I'm gonna play it like one. I don't know, normally I'd hit an eight. I'm thinking full seven at this point. I don't know, we're just playing winter ball. The ball's not going as far. Full seven sounds like the, the right way to send it. Oh, sit, 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 sit. Thin to win, I guess. I think we might actually have like a seven foot birdie putt <laughs> that just bled, bended in perfectly. It's the one downside to winter golf is you blade some of those iron shots with AP2s. 
Oh, I felt that in my fingers. That was not a pleasant feeling at all, but hey, it's a birdie putt, so can you really complain? Wow, that basically I'll stayed dead. To, I, I was expecting that to go left, and it just stayed right out there. Clear the water and get into the fairway. It's gonna be 235, directly into the wind. 255. This is going to take an absolute monster of a tee shot. I don't have a choice. I have to swing as hard as I can at it. I crushed it. I don't know if it even, I mean, it should have gotten over, but we'll see. Question is, where's the play for now? Like, how far out are we? So to carry over, yeah. you're thinking 150, 160? Yeah, I think. Would you be able to keep an eye on this just so that I'm gonna take a crack at it, but. Perfect. Thank you. I had to sprint all the way back to the tee box to get my driver cover, which fell off. Fine. I was playing 130 naturally, but I'd rather go long. I'm gonna hit a three quarter nine, maybe a full nine. I think full nine, actually. Full nine iron, 120 yards. Oh. Hey, that's fine. Doesn't matter, just get it on the green. Gotta sit or go. Holy crap, still short, still 10 yards short. Oh my God. And I crushed that. I crushed the nine iron and it's still short. Wind, help, help me win. There we go. I was getting excited there for a minute because we are walking up and I still didn't see it. I was like, okay, hold up. Thank you. So I think that has us at three over. I'm not sure. I don't have a scorecard. It's not keeping track. I know I bogeyed one, uh, bogeyed two, or did I double two? I don't know. Luckily, everything's on film, so you'll see the final score here. Honestly, not horrendously bad round, considering the wind, the conditions. I'll take it. I was not hitting, as you saw, my irons uh, or hybrids like in positions to like, really let me score. I only had one like really good birdie chance pretty much the entire day. And that's always been the weakest part of my game. Like I'm able to get up and down fine. That's no problem. It's just like, I got to put myself in more positions to get birdie and I just didn't. So it was fun, fun round of nine holes. I had a beautiful course with three people that you don't know, but you get to meet them and talk to them throughout the round, which is a blast. And yeah, not the normal esports content, but I still want to do some golf stuff around here, especially during the off season when I got some time to kill. So I will catch you all on the next video. We'll talk about uh, back to esports because this is probably gonna be the final round of golf for the year. It's getting too cold. The wind today was already bad enough, let alone whenever it gets really cold. So thank you all for tuning in. Catch you on the next one. Adios.